Many couples look at building marital intimacy like they're planting a tree. You put a sapling in the ground, you stake it, you fertilize around it, you water it. Because you know after five or ten years, you don't have to do anything. A tree just grows on its own. And that's sort of how we look at the marriage relationship. In the early days, we protect it, we talk about things, we plan fun times, we, we do things to grow the relationship and thinking then just by getting married and spending time together, marital intimacy will grow. But you know what? Spending 20 years as a married couple expecting that you're going to have intimate oneness is sort of like spending a weekend in a kitchen expecting that a cake is going to be baked. You've got to put the ingredients together. You've got to put them in the oven. You've got to make it happen. I think marital intimacy is actually more like building a brick house that you put together brick by brick. And if at any point you stop building a house, say you get bored or you just say maybe it's not worth it or you've lost that vision, the house doesn't finish itself. In fact, it even gets worse. The elements come in, the weather comes in, and the house will deteriorate. My book, A Lifelong Love, What If Marriage Is About More Than Just Staying Together, seeks to help couples grow together into that intimate oneness. It's what distinguishes it from sacred marriage. Sacred marriage was about how God uses marriage to shape us as individuals. A Lifelong Love is about how God shapes us together as couples. Your marriage can be more. Your marriage can mean more. Join me on this journey of how we don't just build a lifelong marriage, but a lifelong 